And now, our feature presentation. Hello, YouTubers. Happy Easter Day, and welcome to another Disney Pixar Cars Diecast Review. Today, we're going to take a look at the entire Easter-themed car collection from the Cars Easter-themed book, Mater and the Easter Buggy. Before we get right into the review, let me discuss something. <clears throat> it is the year, supposedly, 2011, which it's supposedly two years after the death of Doc Hudson in 2009, and supposedly a few... A two, uh, two or three months, a few months before the events of Cars 2, considering Lightning, that the fact that Lightning McQueen was still in his Hudson Hornet Piston Cup paint job before going into his Wilgren pre paint job. And everyone in Radiator Springs was getting ready for Easter Day. Ramon was painting hoods in Easter colors. Flo was showing off her Easter colors to her customers at the V8 Cafe while giving away some Easter coolant. And Mater was painted in Easter colors as well, and he was excited out of all the other townsfolk. And was ready for the head hunt show of the entire Easter holiday, the Easter Buggy, which is based off of the Easter Bunny. And Lightning McQueen was planning on surprising Mater with some Easter goodies. So he he got some Easter tires from Luigi and Guido. And, and so on and so forth. And he even disguised himself as the Easter buggy while Mater was asleep, but he accidentally tripped over an alarm by Mater's shed and bumped into a stack of tires, which then later on during the book, while Maynard was asleep the third time, BLAM! Lightning bumped into a shelf of Easter colors and got Easter paints all over him, which caused Maynard to wake up the third time and stated that the Easter buggy got a new paint job. Then he, along with Lightning McQueen, went to sleep right outside the entrance of Radiator Springs with their Easter tires. And by morning, the Easter buggy arrived and filled up their tires, which surprised them, the two, when they woke up. The, while... The, uh, while the townsfolk of Radiator Springs started celebrating Easter Day, 
Lightning McQueen and Mater eh, exchanged a happy Easter to one another. While the Easter buggy drove off without being seen or heard. <clears throat> While the book Mater and the Easter buggy itself was published in tw January of 2012, during their diecast releases, the, they were released, the first released in 2017, during the year of Cars 3's premiere in theaters, only five out of the six were released, being Easter Lightning McQueen, Easter Mater, Easter Ramon, Flo, and the Easter Buggy. However, in 2021, the Easter Buggy was re-released in not only 2021, but also in 2022. Yeah. While Lightning McQueen as the Easter Buggy was re only released only one time as a single in 2021, and the whole entire six Easter cars were re-released in 2023. And now, without any further ado, let's dive right into the review for each one of them. First, we're going to start off with Easter Lightning McQueen. So, here we have his bright red paintwork, his headlight stickers with a yellow number 95 on one of them, and his happy facial expression, and a bit of black in between the shiny white teeth, which makes him similar to the Thailand Cars 1 version, which this car, the Cars 1 version itself here, was made in Thailand and updated with the black in between the teeth, making Lightning McQueen himself look similar to the Precision Series version of Lightning McQueen. But anyhow, on, on the hood we've got the Rusty's logo, which is shaded, and a bit of blue and pink, and the lightning bolt stickers splattered all, and the paint splattered all over the, partially splattered. And on both sides we've got the yellow circular borderline trimming on the red rims on the black wall tires and the exhaust pipes, the f a few contingency logos saying Little Torquey Pistons, Revolting, and Mood Springs, and a yellow 95 on a dark red lightning bolt, which is partially covered in, in paint, blue, pink, and yellow, and the gas cap, and on the top, we've got bit of splattered paint, pink, yellow, pink, and blue. And on the sp and on the spoiler, we have a bit of we have bright red with the Rusty's logo. And on the back, we've got the Rusty's logo in the middle, his headlight stickers with the 95 on one of them, and the back bumper which is red with this, retaining the slogan, Medicated Bumper Ointment in yellow, showing that Lightning McQueen is a veteran and not a rookie anymore. And on the undercarriage, it says, 2021 Mattel Disney slash Pixar, made in Thailand. And that is it for Lightning McQueen, for e one version of Lightning McQueen. Up next is Lightning McQueen as the Easter Buggy. Now here we have his, again, his bright red paintwork and his 
headlight stickers with a yellow 95 on one of them and his happy facial expression which he shares the similar body mold to the Hudson Hornet Piston Cup Lightning McQueen and on the hood we've got the Old Rusty's logo which is lightly shaded and the lightning bolt stickers and on both sides we've got the yellow circular borderline trimming on the red rims on the black wall light year racing tires and the exhaust pipes and the gas cap a few constituency logos saying little Tarky pistons revolting and mood springs the Hudson Hornet Piston Cup logo and the yellow ninety yellow number ninety five with a yellow lightning bolt threaded through on a dark red and orange lightning bolt and the Rusty's logo. And on the top we've got the rabbit his, the rabbit ears and a yellow number ninety five partially covered. And on the spoiler we've got the Rusty's logo. And on the back, we've got another Rusty's logo in the middle. The taillight stickers with a yellow number 95 on one of them. The back bumper, which is red and, re and retaining his slogan, medicated bumper ointment in yellow. Again, showing that Lightning McQueen is no longer a rookie. And on the undercarriage, it says Mattel, Disney slash Pixar, made in Thailand. And that is it for both versions of Lightning McQueen in Easter variants. Up next is Easter Mater. Here we have his happy facial expression, his rusty brown paintwork, his left headlight missing, and his right headlight and the partially brown and shabby blue front bumper his engine exposed no hood as usual and his side view mirrors the sirens on top and on both sides we've got the his the brown rims on his black wall tires at the front and a bit of sea green on the door with the yellow blue and reddish purple tires and on the enamel we've got the shabby rusty blue paintwork and the the gas cap and on one side we've got the yellow rim on one of his back tires on his one of his rear tires and on the other side, we've got the white rims on another on another rear tires, and we've got the the tow cable arm and the siren on top, and the his tow cable with the and the working hook, which is similar to the other regular mater that has the working tow hook which I'm still desiring ring and if I ever get the working the regular mater with the working tow hook I'll do a comparison with the other regular mater with the non working tow hook but anyhow on the back we've got the back bumper which is yellow in with black stripes and the license plate saying A113 which is a Pick code number in many Pixar films and the red lights and on the undercarriage it says Disney slash Pixar made in Thailand Mattel and that is it for Easter Mater up next is Easter Ramon here we have his smirking facial expression, his 
bright yellow exterior paintwork with the when pink and white and blue interior we have the headlights and grill which are bright orange and black and on the hood we have a the pink scalps and on both sides we've got the white and pink scalps on the enamel and the gray rims on the black wall tires and on the top we have some white scalps and on the back and on the trunk we've got the pink L-shaped stripes and on the back side we've got the red tail lights and the license plate saying low and slow and the exhaust pipes and on the undercarriage it says Disney slash Pixar Chevrolet which is copyrighted and showing that Ramon is a 1959 Impala lowrider made in Thailand Mattel and that is it for Easter Flow up next is Easter Flow here we have her happy expression her sea green paintwork her headlights and on the hood we got pink borderline trimming and the Motorama logo I assume no tampos on the top and on both sides we got the white wall tires and the pink stripe and a and a chrome silver gray trimming from front to back and on the inside of her tail fins we have a bit of pink and on the her trunk we have a pink the pink circle and on the back we've got the red tail lights and the chrome silver gray metallic back bumper and the traditional license plate saying showgirl and, and on the undercarriage we have the exhaust pipes Disney slash Pixar made in Thailand Mattel and that is it for Easter flow and finally here we have last but definitely not least the Easter buggy which is based off of the Easter bunny so here we have his happy expression two parts of his front bumper which are used as whiskers her his pink exterior paintwork his circular headlights and magenta nose his front teeth and on the hood we've got silver gray on the hood and these in the gray front fenders and on both sides we've got his door with pink and gray on the enamel and the off-road 4x4 tires which are with gray on the rims and the words saying hoplite in white on each one of them and on the top we have gray from top to back and the rabbit ears and on the back we've got the gray back fenders and the exhaust pipes and the red tail lights no back bumper or front bumper and the license plate saying Bongu California and on the undercarriage it says Disney slash Pixar made in Thailand Mattel and that is it so what do you guys think which Easter themed car is your absolute favorite and are you enjoying your Easter today what did the Easter Bunny brought you and
And do you remember Mater and the Easter Buggy? Let me know what you think as well as leaving suggestions in the comments down below. And if you have enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Also, don't forget to check out some of my other videos on my channel. And I hope to see you guys next time for another review, so please stay tuned. Oh, and I also want to remind everyone that today is race day, which is the NASCAR Cup Series' Toyota Owners 400 at Richmond Raceway at 7 p.m. at 7 o'clock p.m. sharp on Channel 8 Fox if anyone has Spectrum on their TVs. Wow. Who kn I mean, who knows what I might be doing until 7 o'clock p.m. then. But anyhow, thank you so much for watching and Happy Easter. Oh, and one more question. And does... Could it be possible that Mater in the Easter Buggy takes place before the events on the same year as Cars 2? But anyhow, thank you so much for watching and Happy Easter Day. Goodbye now!